In this tutorial, I will show you a couple of ways to play around with video files using cues. So, first off, let's add a video. And then link that video to our surface. And now let's enter the edit mode. And like with any other media, video files have their own set of parameters that can be stored in any queue. So, let's start by adding a couple of queues with different starting positions. By selecting an empty queue, and then just clicking on the position parameter to store it in a new queue. And shift clicking to edit and determine the starting position of the video. And then we can select another queue and set another starting point to this one. And then let's make another one. And so now we have three different starting points that we can launch with these queues. Now, let's also create some queues that determine the speed of the video. Let's make one by just clicking on the speed parameter to create a queue with just normal speed. And then let's do one that's slow. And then one that's fast. And then let's also make a queue that makes the video play backwards. And then one that makes it play forwards. And then we can also add a queue that resets the video from the start. And then we can, of course, also add parameters from the surface. And so let's add a couple of cues that gives our video some different colors. And then let's also add the input geometry as it is now in one queue. And then let's make another one that zooms in a bit. And so now we have this setup that we can play around with and we can keep adding stuff and get creative with our project.